Yeah, I'm gonna close this. There's this. Yeah, 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 that's, that's this. I do remember a time when I was doing really well in life. <laughs> well, at least I felt like I was doing really well in life. I feel like I looked through the past through like rose colored lenses in some ways. I think that's the same. Part of me like really wants to bring that past back because I felt back then like I really knew what I was doing. Right now I don't. This is like sort of like taken from Jordan Peterson. Like the analogy of like being in a desert, looking around and like there's just nothing in the horizon. You could go in any direction that you want. And the fact that there's so many directions that you can go in, you're like, okay, do I go this way, this way, this way, this way? Anxiety, that's how I've been feeling. It begs the question, like what direction should I take my YouTube channel, my photography, my creativity in general? my life. It's so bloody hard. <laughs> Why can't it be easy? I kind of like thought of this idea, like what if I like had some lights, the model is like all like draped in like something black or something, then eventually emerges into the light. The light is direction. It's, it's, it's knowing like where to go. Guess what? We got the model. You're kidding. No. Already? Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> I ended up getting approached by Nanlite and they ended up sending me some lights. They're really, really cool. Uh, but the only thing is they didn't send them to me with batteries. I think that you have to buy them separately. That's all good. So it meant that I couldn't like take this photo shoot really elsewhere. I had to kind of do it in my home. Okay, look, obviously that's a lie. I could have taken it to like a warehouse. We could have gone to another location. I get that, but Right now for my lighting, I'm using the Nanlite Paverslim series back here and here. Once you get them out of the box, unstrap these Velcro things on the side and like a soft box just comes out. It's already ready, it's all diffused. That's awesome because when it comes to like other shoots and stuff, if I need it to be ready, it's just ready. It's done. That's what I like about the Nanlite Paverslim series. Back to the video. Oh no, Chris. I realized something. We don't have a third plug. I just check, there's one, two, three. You just said one, two, three and pointed at different places. <laughs> There's one, two, three, right? <laughs> There's like one, two, three. Nah, the plug is in my mouth. I'm like, oh. I'm just gonna f with Hayden's color grading. Okay. Oh. Ah. Uh, struggle, struggle. Now I'm struggle, freezing. Struggle. I'm freezing. Uh, I'm like, uh, oh, I'm hot. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, the Nan lights were really good because you can change the colors on them. You can change the dimness and everything. So it was very useful. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. That's all good. We've got this, maybe. We achieved nothing and the model's here. So this is currently the setup. <laughs> it's cool though. Yeah, I mean. I like the lights. Very nice. Beautiful. Whoa. Uh, Yep. That is super cool. Yeah, you got like contrast between like the faded and. I like him. Damn. I was like getting imposter syndrome. Maybe we should just like get into doing some different. The hard thing about this one is, um, you're, you're doing your thing. Yeah, yeah, okay. You just want to see me eat shit. <laughs> the problem was like, I was so up here. I'm just thinking about the story, like what, what I'm trying to like kind of, that's all right. I think that we should move on to the next one because that one's a bit like, it was like kind of taking me out of the present moment. This might not work because like the way that the lighting is, it might like not work so well, but like, yeah, yeah, something like that. Like, as Chris was taking photos, I was like, you know what? Like, I just, I give up. Do you reckon we just wrap it here? I mean, dude, I could keep shooting. Thank you guys for coming. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much for modeling. Thank you for having me. Chris took me aside and he was like, look, Hayden, like you, you really, you failed on this photo shoot. Like you did not perform on this photo shoot. And like, he's just being honest. Like that's a, that's what a good friend does. Cheers, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> but I agreed with him. Like I was like, I know, I know. Like I didn't do a good job. What what do I do? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I ended up catching up with a friend that I haven't caught up with for a while. He ended up like saying to me that entertainment is a form of love, and that got me thinking. Hmm. Love. So I ended up contemplating that. I went for a walk. I was literally, I was praying, and I was asking like God like please just give me some guidance. Like I, I need some direction in my life at the moment. And so halfway through the walk, I ended up like coming to this realization. And that is that love 
Love is hard. We value things that we have to work for. We value things that are hard, that are difficult. And that really hit me. I was like, thank you, Lord. Like, I wanna do another photo shoot and redeem myself. I want to show myself that I can push through these obstacles and maybe, just maybe, get some bangers. It's not gonna lie, I'm actually kind of nervous, but you know what, that's okay because it's a part of it. I'm gonna close this, there's this. Now, if my calculations are correct, if I put on the smoke machine, there should be a little bit of volume, volume here, like a uh, god raise. I, I think that's what they call. Oh yeah, no. Yeah, oh yeah, that's sick. And that's why I feel like passion implies that you will enjoy yourself all the time, which is just ridiculous. Reaching out towards the light sort of thing. Oh. No. Oh no. I think we should open some doors right now. I just now. feel bad for the neighbors. And open that one. Just smack it. Oh. Didn't work out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well done guys, well done, we got this. I feel like I have like a, a strong sense of direction now because it's like, instead of being like, oh, like my passion, like my, I'm passionate about photography, but sometimes I'm not, so I don't do it sometimes. No, like what if we're like, okay, photography is my sacrifice. Filmmaking is my sacrifice. These things are hard but I'm going to do them regardless of the, whether I think that they're easy or difficult so that I can use that as a means to express love into the world. Oh, that's so cool. You can actually see a re reflection in it as well. If it came to you easy, it's not worthwhile. Because if, if you're just given something, what, you don't value it. I value photography because it's difficult. And a lot of times I don't get bangers, but when I do, oh man, is it good? If we can pick our sacrifices in a way that is going to be conducive to spreading love, then that's beautiful. I'm gonna have a look like shining. Yeah, I was just yep. thinking that. You What'd you say like, about me, Mom? Shining. Huh? <laughs> I reckon 35 yeah. would be alright. You got 24? You could go 24. I do have a 24 oh. to 70. You got 30? Oh, you got one? <laughs> <laughs>